Good morning everyone. Today we are going to talk about polar region. This region presents an extreme cold climate and is usually snow covered. In polar region, uh, it has 6 months of day and 6 months of night. The average temperature in this area is less than minus 10 degrees Celsius and in winters it might be as low as minus 37 degrees Celsius. When we say it is snow covered, what happens is animals like penguins, polar bears, snow leopard, etc. are adapted to these severe conditions. You can see all of these animals try to have the color similar to the snow. A color closer to white is what is preferred and this is because they are trying to form a place themselves and this helps them to escape easily from their predators. Now let's talk about the adaptation of animals living in polar region. Let's start with the polar bear. Now, when we talk about polar bears, it have a camouflage. The second point under the adaptation of polar bear is a thick layer of fat which is present under the skin. It prevents them from getting extremely cold. To maintain the temperature of their body, this thick layer acts as an insulator. These animals move very very slowly and take rest to avoid getting overheated. It is a very good swimmer. It can close its nostrils and remain in the water for more than a minute. It has a strong sense of smell which helps them to locate their prey and has large paws and long curved claws to swim in water and walk easily in snow. That's all about polar bears. Now let's talk about the penguins. Like polar bears, they also have a thick layer of fat. These penguins are very good swimmers. They have streamlined body and web feet. Because of this web feet, they are considered as a very suitable creature for swimming. They usually huddle together to keep them warm. Other than penguins and polar bears, fishes, muskoks, reindeers, foxes, seals, whales and birds are also seen in these polar areas. Fishes can remain in cold water for a long time. But what about the birds? So birds here usually are migratory birds. It means when you have a cold season that start, these birds have the sense to move towards lower latitude or tropical region in order to avoid the severe cold winter. Did you know probably India is one of the destinations of many migratory birds? You might have heard the example of Siberian crane visiting the Bharatpur region in Rajasthan, Sultanpur region in Haryana. Why does this occur every time Siberian crane lands on the same region? That's because they have a very strong sense of direction and again they are able to direct themselves as per the Earth's magnetic field. These are the two primary reasons that they are able to maintain the same path every year. Hope you all got an idea about polar region and the adaptation of animals living in this region.